Look at you. So carefree. You have no schedule. Hey, fuck you, man. Epic Mickey looking ass. Welcome to the Idiot's Guide to League of Legends featuring Huey, the visionary. A painter meets their subject eye to eye. All right, looks like Riot's put out yet another new champion. Yeah, I hope their kid is easy to explain. It looks like a run-of-the-mill mage character. Oh my goodness! Who designed this champion? Riot Emissary? Emissary? Riot, send this dude to the penis exploding machine now! Don't let him ever cook again! So, all three of Huey's basic abilities open a spellbook to three other abilities. His Q, Subject Disaster, gives him access to three abilities, and I'm just gonna save us all some time and just call them what they are. QQ, god that sounds fucking weird to say. Is QQ, Devastating Fire, is Karma Q. QE, Molten Fissure, is Rumble Ult. And QW, Severing Bolt, is Zerath W. It's your run-of-the-mill damage abilities. Uh, by the way, pressing R, Wash Brush, will close whichever spellbook you have open. Is W, Subject Serenity, is the utility set of abilities. Uh, WQ, still doesn't sound right. Fleeting Current grants Huey and his allies movement speed in one direction. WW, still not gonna get used to that. Pool of Reflection creates an AoE that grants shields. WE, that sounds really weird to say, man. Stirring Lights empowers Huey's next three auto attacks. That's not familiar at all. Or abilities causing them to deal bonus magic damage and restore mana. It's your utility and sustain abilities. It's pretty cut and dry. Maybe you could even play him support. I'm joking. Please, please don't play him support. His E, Subject Torment, is the crowd control repertoire. <laughs> yeah, you like that artsy fartsy speak? His EQ, Grim Visage, is a skill shot that fears the first target hit. EW, Gaze of the Abyss, is pretty much Swain's W, except it can root. EE, Crushing Maw, pulls enemies in and slows them and deals magic damage. They must really be running out of original ideas for abilities, aren't they? The entire gimmick is weaving together different spells while typing out an essay like a Rise player on crack. Or just like a Rise player. Hitting damaging abilities will proc his passive, Signature of the Visionary. Damaging abilities mark enemies for 4 seconds, and hitting a marked enemy with a different damaging spell will detonate the mark, creating an explosion beneath the target that deals magic damage. It's honestly the least complicated part of this entire champ. Well, that and his ultimate, Spiraling Despair. I didn't know they named an ability after my mental state. Haha. <laughs> Huey launches a globule, no really, that's what the description says, a globule of pure solo Q, and by that I mean despair at the target. It creates an aura around the first target hit that grows, slows, and deals damage over time to all enemies inside, before detonating after a few seconds, dealing a burst of magic damage. Honestly, I wish I could weaponize my depression like that. I'd be unstoppable. Huey is a really fun character that has a lot of room for skill expression. I mean, 14 abilities is a lot to take in at first, but every ability has its own use. I think Huey is going to be a very strong champ once people get the hang of him, and possibly the next Rise, so to speak. Weak early, but a monster in the late game. His personality is fucking milk toast the best, but hey, at least he's connected the Jin and his lore, so that's interesting. Jin, Jin. Jin, 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 Jin. Yeah, he's really obsessed with Jin. I guess Jin must have criticized his art. I imagine it went something like this. I call it bold and bright. More like belongs in the trash. 